Nature is beautiful, graceful, and perfect. Nature beats hands down anything created by man. However, we do have to give humans some credit for awesome moments when they have manipulated nature and made it even more excellent. One of such instances include the rarest cat breeds in the world. However, not all rare breeds are motivated by humans. Sometimes we just come upon rare animal breeds that beat everything we've ever seen before. The cat family is the favorite of so many and they're really warm as pets. Not all cat family members are good as pets, even when some have been trained to defeat this fact. I mean, lions and tigers are kept as pets now. Without wasting so much time, we should get to the main dish. You should get ready to be worried. You don't want to be taken by surprise. Now let's get it. Here are 20 rarest cat breeds in the world. Number 20. Liger or Tigons Lions and tigers are both royalties in their own rights and spaces. However, what do you think would happen if a tiger and a lion came together to reproduce? Not possible, right? Well, you're wrong to think it's impossible because it already happened. The interbreeding of tigers and lions produce crossbreeds called tigans and ligers. Tigans are offspring of a male tiger and a female lion, while the liger is offspring of a male lion and a female tiger. Ligers and tigans are subred. There are some noticeable distinguishing factors between these breeds and their original parents. Ligers are bigger than their parents because they don't have growth-limiting genes found in female lions. They can grow up to 10 feet long. Tigans, on the other hand, are typically smaller than their parents because they possess those growth-limiting genes in female lions. These differences are biological and sociological. Their species only numbers up to 100 all over the world now. Authorities don't encourage the practice of interbreeding tigers and ligands because of the imbalance in behavioral interactions between the breed and other species. Also, these breeds die shortly after birth due to biological imbalances. Before we begin, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Time for the strange topic. Gather here if you've ever seen a liger and you're so curious to know what it looks like. This picture was taken by one tourist during an expedition in an open wildlife preserve. She, the tourist, had just been rudely smacked across the cheeks by a blind bee and was still hurting and unwilling to take pictures anymore when her eyes stumbled on something far off. She begged the scooter driver to nudge nearer to the new direction of interest and he hesitated for a while. She was getting jumpy and was about to abandon the scooter and walk with her legs when the driver agreed and neared the spectacle. When she came as close as she could get, she hastily took this photo that we can see now. Behold, right in front of her stood a lion with the tiger's stripes. It looked so beautiful and elegant. She got lost staring at the animal that she didn't know when it turned in her direction. From where she stood, she could just guess how tall it was. She was jerked awake from her momentary weakness by the driver as the animal started walking towards them. They managed to get away from it and it didn't chase them. It must have been fascinating to see them so awed by it. Remember to comment down below with the hashtag strange topic and let us know your opinion in relation to what we just showed on screen. And now to the next topic. Number 19. The Fishing Cat Hello aquatic cat. This rare cat species is majorly found in Southeast Asia where it suffers the greatest threat. It is hunted for its meat sometimes and other times for superstitious reasons. Whatever the reasons, this webbed cat deserves more. The fishing cat is outstanding for the bold stripes that outline its short but stout body. It ordinarily stands over 16 inches, 40 centimeters high. For length, the fishing cat spans up to 45 inches to 115 centimeters wide. Its artistically crafted outlook can earn it the most good-looking cat out there. It has a camouflaged gray-brown fur with distinctive black spots and stripes. It has six or more black lines running from its forehead to its neck. Its eyes are ringed with white fur and its ears are short and round. The best part of this cat is the webbed feet. Their front toes are partially webbed, which helps them be the awesome swimmers they are. Its claws protrude slightly even when retracted so that they can easily fish their prey in the sea. We can call these guys the sea cat. However, this cat is short. It doesn't grow taller than 16 inches. They are stout and strong with short limbs. 
They weigh as much as 30 pounds. The adult male fishing cat is capable of weighing 31 pounds to 14 kilograms. Number 18. The Iberian Lynx Do you like bearded men around you? Do you like them trimmed or bushy? What about a cat? Have you ever seen a cat with a beard? The Iberian Lynx might just be the only animal with the most beautiful beard. The heavily spotted cat family member is always in comparison with its close sibling, the Eurasian Lynx. These cats stand out for their gait. Of course, all cats are graceful and elegant, but it's just unique with both lynxes. The feline citizen declined by 87% from 1985 to 2001. This was thanks to human activities in their habitats, scrublands. Their homes were converted to dams, farms, highways, railways, and factories. Conservation activities in recent years are trying to improve that number now. The Iberian or Spanish lynx has some amazing features that make them stand out. It weighs 13 kilograms to 35 pounds. It comes with long legs and a short tail with a black tip. Its beige coat is spotted with dark circles. Around its face, the cat sports a short beard. A recovery program was launched in 2002 to save the breed. They would capture the animals and mate them. As per the last report, their population has increased to 400 in 2019. The Iberian lynx was also delisted from critically endangered to endangered species in 2015. Number 17. The Flat-Headed Cat This cat is a domestic cat, and it is cute. Just like the name goes, this cat has a unique flattened forehead. Its features and behavior are not characteristic to a domestic cat, but it is lovable. The flat head is naturally not tall. This doesn't mean it is a dwarf. Instead, it has short limbs and rather strange paws. Its paws are round, very rounded ones. Like the fishing cat, its claws do not retract entirely. It has more adaptations for aquatic life than the fishing cat. Its toes are completely webbed and they have long and narrow foot pads. Their teeth are inside out in order to catch prey effectively, fish and frogs. They are typically better swimmers than the fishing cat. The semi-aquatic carnivore has a short fuzzy tail. It is thickly furred with reddish brown above and yellowish underneath. It does not hide its tail like other cats. The muzzle, chin, and cheeks are white, speckled with short, white stripes at the inner edge and also along the lower margin of its eyes, and two dark streaks on each cheek. It is indeed a beautiful cat. They have an elongated body and short legs. The coat is thick, soft, and long, reddish brown on top of the head and dark brown on the body, with the fine speckling of gray and buff on the tips. A yellow line traces from each eye to near the rear. Its underparts are white and sometimes spotted and splashed with brown. Its large brown eyes are set closely together and short, rounded ears are set well down the sides of the head. The legs are short and can have some indistinct horizontal markings. Number 16. The Borneo Bay Cat I think I have finally found my spirit animal. This cat is as shy as I am. It rarely appears on camera, so experts have called it extremely secretive. They are closely related to the Asian golden cat who is equally shy. It has a bright chestnut colored fur with black stripes that come down from the eyes. Underneath the luxurious fur is a white where the cat's chin is. It is smaller in size when compared to the Asian golden cat. It is an endangered species with a declining population majority due to loss of habitat. The bright red-brown cat is estimated to total 2,200 mature adults. It is doing fairly well compared to other cats that have been mentioned earlier. Scientifically known as the Catopuma badia, the cat mostly lives in the forests of Indonesia and Malaysia. Most of these forests have been lost to deforestation. Others have been lost to civilization. The cat is so secretive that experts have been unable to monitor its reproduction and hunting choices. Its body spans from 19 to 20 inches and it weighs over 8 pounds. The tip of this cat's tail is all black. Bornean bay cats are approximately 19 to 20 inches and weigh between 6 and 9 pounds. They are hunted for their meat sometimes and it's also reducing their population. Number 15. Andean Cat Here's another short cat. The wildlife has the thickest fur on this list. They only weigh 4 kilograms and stand over 20 inches. Its fur is 40 to 45 millimeter on its hind skin. Its pale silvery fur is irregularly speckled with vertically arranged rust color. It has visible dark stripes running down its sides and gray bars also run across the forelegs and chest. The underwear is pale colored with dark spots. 
The tail is thick and long with 6 to 9 dark brown rings. In some Andean cats, the tip may be a pale white color. The tail is the most prominent figure of this cat. It covers more than 70% of its body. That is around 410 to 485 millimeters. It uses the tail to protect itself from cold and tuck its nose in. While hunting on the mountain, it also uses the tail to balance its weight. They're mostly found in mountain sides because the tail's underside has hair that is long and as thick as the upper side. It appears perfectly round. The spotted cat loses its spots as it ages and experts don't show anything about its reproduction yet. The feline member is the most threatened species in all of America. They've almost halved 1400 and scientists warn that it could be worse. They're hunted severely for the fur trade, which is the second best after the mountain chinchilla. There are existing programs that are working to resolve the extinction problem of the Andean cats. The Andean Cat Alliance of 1999 is one of them. Its projects include educational and national projects to protect the species. Number 14. The Marbled Cat This cat has two color varieties. While some marbled cats have dark gray-brown fur, others will have yellowish-gray fur, and the rest will have red-brown fur. They're similar to the larger clouded leopard. The field member has enlarged canines, broad feet, and blotched coat pattern. Its face is short and broad with well-rounded ears and a really long tail like the Andean cat. The tail is equally round like the Andean cat. The fur is not as thick as the Andean's, but it is quite thick and soft, well-grown woolly underfur. The blotches on its back are quite large and irregular in their shape. The legs and underwear are patterned with black spots. This is another secretive cat where scientists know very little of its habitat, feeding habits, and reproduction. They believe that it prefers the dark, but even that is not confirmed. It is guessed to feed on birds, squirrels, rats, and even small reptiles. Because of its elusiveness, nothing is known of its population size. Scientists believe that the cat cannot accommodate human disturbance. However, it has been classified as near threatened. Number 13. The Eriamote Cat I promised that not all cats are spotted, but here's another spotted cat on our list. This feline is a dark brown cat with darker spots that merge into bands. They're as small as domestic cats and have quite a long body. The legs and tail are short. It has white splotches on its back and at the back of its well-rounded ears. The eyes of this cat are quite charming against its skin color. Its irises are a yellowish gold, glowing like flame against the sunlight. Around its eyes are small white spots. The Iriamote is only found on the Japanese island it took its name from, Iriamote. The small island of 284 square kilometers is located in the southwestern zone of Japan. Its low elevations are perfect for the cats as scientists have observed. The Iriamote loves to dwell in wetlands, streams, small hills, and wander around sandy beaches. They practically live around humans. Their population was just 100 in 1982 but is now considered to be declining over the past decade. Other than human threats, this cat species faces extinction due to competition and interbreeding with feral domestic cats. The offspring are usually weak and don't last. This is seriously threatening their existence. They've lost a significant amount of their habitats to farms and highways. The region is now a wildlife protection area called the Iriamote Wildlife Protection Area, and Japan's Environment Agency has set up a feeding and monitoring program with a view to increasing their numbers. Number 12. The Vermilla Cat this is a crossbreed cat from a chinchilla Persian male and a lilac Burmese bred. The first time it appeared was in 1981, and it was an accident. However, when the cat owners saw that the offspring was good, they liked it. Soon a breeding program was launched to produce these cats. The offspring is unique for its black-tipped coloring. Scientists wanted to produce a cat that would have such short hair and the roundness of the initial cats. The cat is now rare in Britain and is still not accepted by major registries. The cat is still seen as an experimental breed. They're domesticated cats that love to climb a lot so owners have to provide them with cat trees. They also love attention a lot. The cat has a strong potential of getting overweight so it needs its daily exercise. It is a round, sturdy, and stocky cat. They love being petted and demand daily petting sessions. Like other pets, it needs to be brushed daily to eject dead hairs. They usually weigh 8 to 12 pounds and come with green eyes. It's a socially moderate cat and can live for up to 7 or more years. Overall, the Bromilla is an adorable cat. Number 11. 
the Turkish Van Cat. This is one of the cat exports from Turkey. The cat was first introduced to the UK in 1955 after two kittens were brought into the region from Turkey. The cats were carefully bred to reproduce the Turkish van cat we have today. This cat stands out for its color distribution. Its body is white and color appears only on the head and the tail. Awesome, yeah? There are cases of vans with splotches of color on their body, but it's very rare. There are some exceptions to these color variations, however. The Turkish Van Cadisi is known to be extremely white. These domesticated cats are popular in the United States, but only 100 kittens are born per year. This makes it popular, but rare. They are quite intelligent and friendly cats who demand moderate attention. It has a sturdy build and is very playful and active. The cat also loves the water and in some cases, it is said that the cat can actually swim. Its coloration is a result of the piebald gene which gives it the red, cream, black, blue color with large spots of white covering their bodies. This gene causes the white to appear all over the body, not in splotches. Number 10. The Korat Cat this is another breed found in the Americas. It is a minority cat breed caused by a small gene pool found in it. They originated from Thailand. The gene pool can be increased with more imports and the restrictions on breeding and populations make it impossible. Hence, you can only import them but not breed them. This has made the breed quite rare and highly priced in the cat market of the United States. They first arrived in the US in 1959. In its homeland, Thailand, the cat is of greater value than money. The cat is known as the Sai Sawat cat because of its good luck charm. They have emerald green eyes and silvery blue fur. They are believed to date back to the 14th century according to ancient literature. The Karat cat is a treasured gift both in Thailand and the United States. They are especially special to brides and newlyweds as it represents fertility and prosperity respectively. The cats are named after a region in Thai where they're believed to originate from. The natural breed was recognized by the Cat Fanciers Association in 1967. The Karat Cat Fanciers Association arrived two years later to promote the breed. However, this has done little to popularize the breed. The cat is smart but very demanding of attention. It is easy to train and prefers a quiet environment. It is possessive and rarely lets go of its owners. It weighs 6 to 10 pounds and is as tall as 15 to 18 inches. It lives for 10 to 15 years. Number 9. The Sosoki Cat this cat is naturally bred, so it developed without human intervention. They originated from the Arabuko Sosoki forest in Kenya. It is believed that they arrived in Europe in the 1970s when a couple brought them to Denmark. It began to spread around Europe and only got popular after a 2001 documentary by Jeannie Knocker put it on the cat map of the region. They were accepted into the International Cat Association TICA, registry in 2004. They are sociable cats that have a lot of energy to spend. It is compared to a dog because of its athletic nature. It is quite intelligent and demands a lot of attention from its owners. Like dogs, Sosokis are very loyal. They can be taught tricks and can learn to play catch, one game they love so much. They cannot stay alone, so they always need a companion. Their sizes vary, so it doesn't have a standard. However, they're decided as medium-sized. They weigh some 6 or 10 pounds and are very healthy. They climb a lot and love to play with water. They are indeed very active. Their fur is easy to manage, another reason families love it a lot. Number 8. The Minskin Cat This is a crossbreed of the Sphinx and the Munchkin cat breeds. The cat has an eerie appearance that earned it the evil nickname, but it is twice as nice as any other cat out there. The cat's body is hairless and has very short legs. Its name is a combination of miniature and skin. It inherited the hairlessness from the Sphinx and the shortness from the Munchkin. It has a stocky body and is usually a silvery gray in color. It is very sociable with animals and humans alike. They have large round eyes and a round face. Their ears are equally large and their heads are round. It's a round cat. It loves the outdoors and is quite affectionate with its family. On its facials, it has patches of hair. They first appeared in Boston by cat fancier Paul McSorley. He wanted to create a cat with points of fur similar to the color points on a Siamese. He made the first attempt in 1998. 
He made the Minskin first, then he later crossed Burmese and Devon Rex cats. By the time he achieved his desired result in 2000, he could no longer stop and continued until 2005, by which time he had created 50 new cats. Number 7. The Chartreux Cat A monk's cat. The Chartreux Cat originated from France and dates all the way back to the 16th century. Knights returning to ancient Persia are said to have brought the cat to France. They are believed to have stayed with monks in their monasteries before they were brought up to France. Like monks, the Chartreux has a quiet and observant temperament. They are widely known for preferring to speak with their eyes other than their mouths. They are believed to be named so for the Carthusian monks who they lived with. Because of its rarity, it is heavily prized among its peers. It comes with a gray wooly fur that smooths to the touch. The hair is not thick, so it is easy to maintain. It is a natural breed which makes it even more unique. It is also priced for its fur and thick blue pelts which are used to make a luxurious wool called Pile de Chartreux. This makes them high targets for furriers in France. It has greatly affected the population of the cat. It was after World War I that cat owners decided to protect the breed and keep it from extinction. They gathered as many cats as they could and wrote a breed standard, which allowed them to display cats that meet the standard and save them. The Chartreux weighs between 7 and 16 pounds and is medium sized. It loves to nap a lot and can be agile sometimes. It prefers to relax most of the time, displaying its perfectly rounded stocky body. He is quite sociable too. Number 6. The Havana Brown Cat Green on brown never looks so good before. This cousin of the Siamese is chatty and loves to lap a lot. His coat is soft, making it easy for the owner to groom. The amiable cat is however heading to extinction. The agile feline member comes in a glorious tobacco brown coat and a bright pair of green eyes. He is long, muscular, and medium-sized. For now, only less than a thousand of the cats exist in the world. It weighs up to 5 kilograms for the males and 3 kilograms for the females. They live for a maximum of 13 years and are moderately sociable. They can be playful this minute and want to be by themselves the next minute. It is recognized by three cat associations, namely CFA, ACFA, TICA. Its head is triangular with a sharp chin. The ears and eyes of the Havana cat are medium in size. The glossy fur has a mahogany undertone that is unique to this breed alone. They can get overweight, so its nutrition needs close watching. They are not a natural breed and happened by accident in England in 1952. The first ever Havana Brown Cat was named Elm Tower Bronze Idol. Number 5. The Egyptian Mao Cat Like their name suggests, this cat originates from Egypt and for specifics, the Egyptian temples. They are among the oldest domestic cat breeds in the world today. Their forefathers were worshipped in temples. Their coat has splodged and it's so unique from others. It is respected for its elegance and history among cats. The rare breed has less than 3,000 members across the world. It can live for 15 years tops and can weigh a maximum of 6 kilograms for the males and 4 kilograms for the females. Right here. Their origin in Egypt dates back to over 3,000 years ago when the Egyptian goddess Bastet was worshipped in the form of a lioness and then a cat which looked like the mouse. It carries a unique, worried look on its face. Mao means cat in Egypt. The feline member can be found in countries like France, Italy, and Switzerland where they started breeding in early 20th century. Their population decreased greatly after the Second World War. Number 4. American Bobtail Cat the cat was a result of crossbreeding in 1960. It is the offspring of a domestic tabby cat and a wild bobcat. The rare breeds are also called golden retrievers. It comes with a short tail thanks to crossbreeding. They are very playful, friendly, and full of energy. They cannot necessarily stay alone. They have a rugged appearance that goes well with their bobbed tails. Good boy, bring it here. Bring me your toy. They are playful with humans but not necessarily with other animals. They are quite pricey in the cat market in the United States. It is human bred and was not accidental. All their original bloodlines have passed away. Number 3. American Wirehair Cat Natives of New York, 
The wiry-haired cat is a natural breed. The most outstanding feature of the cat is the curly hair. They are true New Yorkers in that they can stay on their own for long hours while their owners work for long hours. They are easygoing and friendly cats so they don't jump on strangers or scratch around. Because of its rareness, the cat is quite pricey. It ranked 41 in the Cat Fanciers Association of Most Rare Breeds in 2017. Scientists believe that the cat is a spontaneous mutation of the American Shorthair, another cat that is known for its jagged hair. It first appeared in Vernon in 1966 in a barn. A breeder bought the first wire-haired male, was named Council Rock Farms Adams of Hi-Fi from its owner along with a normal coated female called Tip Top to begin a breeding program. The offspring is the wiry-haired cat we have today. Number 2. The La Perm Cat the perm began to exist in 1982, when barn owners Linda and Richard Cole of the Dallies, Oregon, found that their great tabby mouser called Speedy had just had a strange kitten. Speedy had two kittens and La Perm was the stranger of the two. Unlike its sibling who looked fuzzy, La Perm was bald with tabby stripes on its skin. Its coat was exceptionally wavy by week 8. The waves, according to genetics, were as a result of a dominant gene found in one parent. She was first named Curly and she bore five tomcats of her own. The Coles did not expect her to last that long. The cats mated with different neighboring cats and produced a variety of different colored curly coated cats. The fur length in the cats varied as did their patterns and colors. Linda showcased the cats at a cat show in 1992 and thus began its popularity. Though the perms were officially recognized by the ICA in 2003, the cat is usually medium sized with large flare ears. Number 1. Norwegian Forest Cat These cats first existed in Norway and gained entry into the world beyond the Norwegian borders when the war began. History believes the cat ventured out of Norway through boats that belonged to the Vikings. The male and female NFC weigh less than 5 kilograms, making it quite easy to lap. Its eye colors vary from green, blue, and gold. They can live for a maximum of 14 years and they need a lot of attention. Their coat is straight and comes with various colors like white, black, blue, red, cream, silver, golden, red, cameo, blue cream, brown, and sea green. Its coat is long and requires high grooming. The cat is very sociable and loves to interact with its parents a lot. They have heavy bones and their long fur makes them look way bigger than they actually are. They're very muscular. Too. Among these rare cat breeds and the story behind them, which we have discussed here, which one catches your fancy the most? Which one would you not mind adopting as a pet? You should check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. See you next time now.